who knows all the countries in the world or even knows the basics about all these countries. In this small series, I would therefore like to give you an overview of those countries of the world. This includes a brief overview of the most important data on their political system. And today it is about the Dominican Republic. And that's also the official name Dominican Republic or in original Republica Dominicana. The form of government is a presidential democracy. There is a national assembly, a congress consisting of uh, 32 seats and a chamber of deputies with 190 seats. The head of state and prime minister is Luis Abinader Corona from the Partido Revolucionario Moderno, the PRM, and he's in office since August 16, 2020. Representative of the head of state is the vice president Raquel Peta Atares from the PRM as well since August 16, 2020. The foreign minister is Roberto Ivares Gil from the PRM since uh, August 16th as well. It's only 89th place on the Human Development Index. The Dominican Republic consists of 31 provinces and the capital district of Santo Domingo. It is a parliamentary democracy, but its constitutional institutions are still weak. Human rights are essentially respected. The president, who has great powers, is also head of government and commander-in-chief of the army and police, and is directly elected for four years, most recently on July 5th in 2020. By far the most important branch of the economy is tourism. The country has had very high growth for years. It of course has been hit hard by the largely lack of travel due to the COVID-19 crisis. There is considerable migratory pressure from Haiti, which many Dominicans are critical of. The government wants to improve the legal situation of people of Haitian origin. The crisis in Venezuela is also leading to an increase in immigration from there. Almost 2 million Dominicans live in the USA. The population is mostly Catholic. The Catholic Church has great influence there. The number and importance of the evangelical churches are noticeably increasing. The country is an important transit country for drugs from South America to the USA and Europe. And it's bad to end with this, but unfortunately it is like it is. And if you want to stay informed, please subscribe to my channel and to my other channels. I'll see you in my next video. Auf Wiedersehen.